Japan, an archipelago prone to earthquakes and subsequent tsunamis, has been developing its own tsunami research and warning systems, and is offering its expertise to create a warning system in the Indian Ocean. At the Tsunami Research Center near Tokyo, a tsunami simulator with a 180-meter-long indoor water channel generates artificial tsunami waves up to 2.5 meters high. Scientists here are examining how human beings, housing structures, and other objects may get swept away by various types of waves, and these research results are reflected upon the nation's advanced tsunami warning network. At the heart of the network is JMA's computerized earthquake and tsunami observation system. That monitors signals from 180 seismic stations across Japan, and about 80 waterborne sensors 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. The weather agency and media have developed an online system to superimpose alerts on TV screens as soon as they are issued. And in some areas, there is even a system that automatically turns on TVs in the event of an evacuation order. But agency officials say the monitoring and the warnings would be useless if they did not reach the public. It's not enough just to issue tsunami warnings in advance. What makes them work is to establish a means to get the warnings to local residents, and for them to make sure they immediately evacuate the area once they receive a warning. Kamigaichi added that the agency aims to issue tsunami alerts within three to five minutes after a quake that occurs in or near Japan.